Hey guys, RBO here. Today we're going to be going over the Spain MRE. Just a single ration. Uh, Customs did crack this and they stole my ham and beans or the paperwork. But other than that, everything else should be in there, hopefully. But we're going to go ahead and get into it. So you can see they just go ahead and cut it open. And here's our menu. There's the English one. There you go. This is lunch B, menu number five. You can go ahead and pause and read that if you like. But I'm gonna put this to the side and I'm gonna double check just to make sure everything else is in there. <clears throat> Comes in this little cardboard box. Crack it open, got a whole bunch of good little goodies. Pretty sure this is peaches. This is the peaches. Which I had a thing in the box that was shipped in and it said customs open it up and inspect it and then it said agriculture. I thought they were gonna take the peaches. Okay. Pretty sure that's the soap uh powder. Which I'm not quite sure how we're gonna cook that up. Then we have our calamari and oil. Matches. That's gonna be four of these fuels. Heat up your meals. Our meal. And then these are going to be need to be translated. That might be, it feels like coffee. This is disinfect, disinfectant, maybe some kind of hand cleaner. Okay, so this is toothpaste. This is cream, crema dental fluoride, Florida, fluoride. Um, here goes another one, so that might... That definitely might be a coffee. I don't know if they have a lot of coffees in these. But it does look like that. They have a cool emblem on there. I like that. Crest. Could it be? Here we have something small. Water purification tablets, most likely. Yeah. The agua. Yeah. That's sick. I don't think we're going to be able to use those today, but that is dope. To have in there. Well, this feels like a piece of gum. Hmm. Pretty sure. I'm gonna have to double check here. I was supposed to have a uh, toothbrush. So I'm gonna go look on the website real quick and see if that's what it was supposed to be in here. Oh, you have your napkin. And you have your folding stove. Also, gotta look up video on this. <laughs> so we'll be right back, and we'll get. I'll get. I'll come back when I get the stove set up, so I can show you guys that. Turns out we're not gonna need the stove because we don't have ham and beans. So let's get to throwing stuff out on the tray. Turns out these are not coffees. These are vitamin C packets. So yeah, and this is hand disinfectant. And this is toothpaste, obviously. I already said that. Alright. Uh, I guess. Let's just, let's just pour our drink first. Or mix our drink. Steve said he wished he could buy this in stores because it's so good. So I'm looking forward to it. Hopefully it's the same kind of stuff he had. Give it a whiff. Hmm. That is a different smell. But I don't hate it. It's different, but it smells good. I don't know if I can describe it. It smells like a German chocolate shop. It's so sweet. Where did I put the stone? I don't. 
Okay. We use our good old spoon. Next up. Not looking too appetizing, but now it just smells like pure tropical fruit. We're gonna let that sit over there and let it ponder. Next up, because I'm interested about this, is our soup. Let's move this back a little bit, just make sure we get this in frame. Hopefully, I don't make too much of a mess. Just said it's vegetable soup. So, let's get it. Hmm. It smells like ramen without a scent, kind of. Tastes like a Thanksgiving soup. Looks like there's like breadcrumbs or not crumpets. Um, keeps escaping my mind. What's on salads? Croutons. So that's just a little bit left. Which I usually would put a little water in there and splash it in there just to get the rest, but. Now we are going to try out this toothpaste afterwards and we're about to see what this smells like and we're going to eat the gum. Yeah, I just love, I love their military's insignia or just the MRE companies, I don't know, but that's awesome. Plain piece of Orbitz. Yeah, it's orbits. It's kind of a big piece. But give it its own little space. We'll do peaches first. I don't know, I'm just 50 50 in the calamari. But it is what it is. So you can get a hiss. If you're wondering my hand, why my hands are so cut up, it's because I was doing yard work, so. Oh yeah, that was nice. Mmm. Look at those. Give those a whiff. Mmm. Very good. Very sweet. Tastes a little bit like tin. Oh, this is. Get three halves. That fills it to the rim. Heck yeah. I love cans and MREs. No US at Marie's, or nowadays at least. I love cans. Get everything mixed up in there. <clears throat> I wanted the garlic calamari menu, but they were all uh, sold out. So I took what I can get. I didn't really hear anything. I better stop smelling them. You know, they're smelling as well, calamari and oil filled can can. Let me get this can open. Hopefully without getting it everywhere. One moment. And we're back. We got it open. The 
opener popped off, so I just pried it with a flathead. And here we are. So we're gonna go ahead and try this stuff out. I just, mm, well, I hope you guys like this demonstration because it's just 100%, 1000% pure uh, hand sanitizer and I have a blister or had, so. I guess I don't need to add any peroxide to either one of these. Hmm. It does have a very strong scent to it, but the clean scent, very nice scent. It doesn't smell like normal hand sanitizer, but it does sting a little bit. As it should, though. Okay, you know the alcohol content's good in the hand sanitizer. Or the disinfectant. Okay, that's very nice. Very nice. Let's go ahead and try this soup. I hope I might have watered down this a little bit too much. I don't think I did, actually, but... Let's give her a try. Mmm. Oh my. Nope. Didn't water it down at all. That is delicious. That's like... It low-key tastes like the broth of wonton soup. That's literally what I taste. Very good. And then these little bread things are... Gets a little starch, I guess. But... They're pretty much exactly what comes out of a salad. Oh, croutons in the soup. But it's very good. Very, uh, like sodium. But sodium's always good. Because when you're in the field, you're sweating. Gotta replace that sodium. And we're gonna try our drink. After you give it a little mix. <laughs> Looks like gutter water. Then you give it a taste. How do you describe that? It's like someone soaked it in Skittles. That's what it tastes like. It tastes like you're tasting a rainbow. Literally, I was going to say rainbow, but then Skittles came into mind, so that's how it tastes. Oh no. Oh yeah, that's a solid uh, peach there. Just grab it. Look at that. That is a nice piece of peach meat. Mmm. So sweet. It's a good peach. Let's try the juices. Mm. Very good. Very sweet. Still has a structure in it. Doesn't taste like it's canned anymore since you get it out of the can. So I definitely recommend getting it out of the can to eat it. Could taste normal now. Now all that's left is the uh, Grand Slam. Let me actually... Hey, got a fork. You guys ready? This is from your coffee. You guys ready to try this stuff out? And there you go, guys. Just, oh, oh, it leaked out my hand. Oh, the smell's getting more intense. Hmm. I don't know if it's just like the mental thing of it, but I guess you gotta get over it. Hmm. You know? It's not that bad. 
it's just the the texture and when you see it like that you're not used to it but it's not like a bad bad taste it actually tastes uh kind of like shrimp a little bit if you stir fry it but um yeah we're gonna try this gum now we're gonna try, let's try the toothpaste first I really know how it works you might just pop it in your mouth Okay, that's dope. It's like a single use little mouthwash. You just pop out, right in your mouth, and just swish it around. Get your mouth clean, get your taste buds, taste buds clean. And at the end, you just pop your gum in. Or if anything, you pop your gum in at the same time, and you let that be the abrasive thing. And it goes around, getting everything cleaned up. Well, there you go, guys. That's the uh, Spaniard. Um, squid and oil MRE. Sorry, I'm drawing. I'm like, just this piece of gum is actually pretty big. It's just a mouthful. The calamari and oil, my bad. But it was pretty good MRE. Tell me what you guys think in the comments. And thank you guys for watching the video. Have a good day.